you raise your voice when you are home with your children and they also raise their voices, it, life becomes chaotic. What's up guys? Welcome back to Linda Insights. My name is Linda and this is my dad, Ron, and we're back for Father Fridays again. I am so excited. Are you excited? I am Indeed? very excited. Yep. Do you know what we're talking about today? I don't know. Today? You tell me. I'm here. Okay, so I was watching this video and the guy was talking about how we have become human doings instead mm. of human beings. Okay. And I sat there for a, mem for a moment and I was like, whoa, mm. I'm a human doing. All I do is just do stuff. And I've lost the concept of what it means mm. to be a human being. Mm. And so I wanted to talk to you about that today. What do you think about that comment or that saying we're human doings instead of being human beings well it is unfortunate that we become human doings yeah human doings. <laughs> because that's not what god created mm -hmm. god created human beings yeah. uh, when you are being you are original when you are being it means you are in touch with other beings. Mm -hmm. the, moment, the moment you come to the concept of being a human doing, there is an element of selfishness. Yeah. There is an element of inward looking. There is an element of ego, mm -hmm. bad ego. <laughs> it's, it's when you do stuff in order to attract attention to yourself. Okay. Uh, it's when you think just about yourself. And when you think just about yourself, then you miss tapping into this tapestry of the... Tap of what? Oh. <laughs> what? Oh. Tapestry. It, it means... <laughs> the art of coming together of different okay, things. Okay, okay, yeah, that makes so, <laughs> a lot more sense. <laughs> yeah, so you, you miss you miss on that and, and you become just like a part of a machine that wants to work alone. Forgetting. It's like a hamster wheel. Like, you know, I've also heard some people um, say that now humans, we're like hamsters. We just mm -hmm. get on that wheel and we just go and go and go. We don't even know where we're going. Exactly. And yeah. When you do that, there's no fulfillment. Ooh. You don't tap into your inner, deeper being where there is a deep-seated joy of being alive. Hmm. So then, what is the meaning of life and what are the two things that we can start doing so that we cannot be human doings and instead go back to being human beings? Uh, there are several things. One, every person on earth mm -hmm. finds joy, finds meaning when they are able to help someone else. Okay, be in the service of other people. Being in service of other people. Uh, once we miss that and be in the service of serving ourselves, we've lost it. Okay. We just become like a machine that has no life, that has no feelings. Just, just, just like my watch, see? Uh -huh. This thing was created to serve me. Uh -huh. <laughs> it, it, it does not know what it is doing. It's for me to use it to check on my time. Uh -huh. But as a human being, you, you have to be connected. You have, you have feelings, you have emotions, um, you need peace, you need joy, you need love. Okay, so the first thing is just be in the service of others. Can that look different for each person? Because, like being in the service of others. What do you mean look different? What do you mean? Uh, like, what I, like what I am able to do to serve others is going to be different than what you do to serve others. But the bottom line yeah. is uh, So it can yeah. be different. Oh yes, okay. oh yes. As long, as long as you are not doing something in a selfish way, with a selfish motive. Yeah. As long as you want to make a world, the world a better world for everyone to live in. Okay. You can do it for a child, for a mm -hmm. grown-up, yeah. for colleagues. In whichever or, way in that whichever you want way. to. Okay. Yes, in whichever way. And then what would be a second way that, or thing that we could start 
doing so that we can become human beings? Ah, good. You don't have to start doing. doing. Okay, yeah, I'll call myself <laughs> yeah. that. I was like, mm, that's you have, you have to be okay. being, okay. you know. And one of those is finding peace. What are the things that give you peace? Hmm. When, when you are at peace, you are at a place where uh, you create something contagious in your own environment. You, it, peace can be spread. It's the good vibes. Ah, it's the good vibes, yeah. yes. How, how do you do that? Well, you have to have inner peace first. <laughs> how do you even get to that inner peace though? Like, well, what does that look like? Then it, looked like some, it looks like something like this. Okay. When you are a parent, Mm -hmm. and you come from work and you're tired and things didn't go well at work uh -huh. you raise your voice when you're home with your children and they also raise their voices <laughs> it life becomes chaotic but if you have peace uh -huh. even when things are not well there is a power that you tap into which is infectious okay. which which can be spread which can be uh, felt through those vibes that you're mentioning by the people oh, around yeah, that's you. True. Mm. Mm -hmm. Doing for a good cause, yes, and that's not called doing, it's part of being. being. Yes, but when you do for a selfish cause, things go wrong. So like, I live a very busy life. Sometimes I leave the house by seven something and get home at midnight. Is that, how would you, should I slow down? Like, how do I make sure that I'm being a human being and not just doing? Well, wherever you go, there are people around you. Whatever you do, mm -hmm. there are people around you. And I can still find a way to uh -huh. be in service of others and then bring peace with me in doing that? Okay, just sorry, pay attention. I just it's all right. <laughs> just pay attention. And, and all it takes, sometimes that the ability of being is just to smile. It's just to let someone cross the road, even when you're in a hurry. Okay. Do the good things. It's not even mm -hmm. doing, it's just being yourself. Yeah. Be natural. Yeah. Be original. Well, thank you, Father, for having this conversation with me. And I want you guys to think, are you a human being or have you turned into a human doing? And what are the simple steps like being in the service of others and also being um, at peace first with yourself and then uh, with others? Uh, I messed that up and I forgot what I was saying exactly. So what does that look like for you? Well, that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed and see you next Friday. Bye. Bye.